So sometimes the filler is separate from the washer on the bottom, but this particular model is not, and you have to remove this washer arm here to get access to the filler, but it's not a problem. All you need to do is turn it to the left like this, and it'll pop right off. Now you've got this assembly off too. It's actually a good idea to take everything off here. If you can see how dirty and grimy that is in there. Same with the bottom of the washer arm. It's not very nice. And we have a bit of kale in here, by those things. And see how dirty that is in there. Now further in, you'll see there's a little bracket in here. Now this doesn't come out. You have to get a screwdriver to take this out, but it's kind of catching everything here. So I'm going to clean this out too. Go over to the sink to wash everything off. Reassembly is the opposite of how it came apart. So you put the big dish in first, and then you put that bottom filter in. And then all it's left to do is just reconnect the washer arm. Now if you don't have the washer arm connected to the filler like this, then you don't have to do this part. But you just turn the washer arm to the right and it's locked in place.